G'day everyone, Rod Moore here from Moore Art School. Hope you're all well. Just thought I'd do a, uh, a live stream for you, um, which has got a little bit of a delay. So if you do ask a question or comment, then just know that there is a bit of a delay. Uh, but yeah, I thought I'd do a, uh, a live stream for you on starting an art teaching business. And lately I've had a few conversations with a number of people who have had an interest in starting their own art teaching business and, and they've found me through whatever, you know, YouTube, Facebook, whatever it's been. And, um, you know, so it's just occurred to me that if you are thinking about starting an art teaching business, then now's the time. Like if you want to get ready for 2018, now's the time you really need to start uh, getting into motion for that because um, what you'll find is that in order to really launch a business, you needed some time, some preparation and time and so on. So I thought I'd share with you, and, and right now, you know, the more certified instructor program is going along quite nicely. We've got, uh, you know, some great people have just joined us in the UK, a um, couple more in the USA, and I've got, you know, people who are in the program who are doing their tests, classes and so on, which is really exciting. And I just thought it might be an ideal time just to have a chat with you. Uh, for those of you who are interested in teaching art, um, have a chat with you about that and um, ways that you can get yourself into a position where you can start teaching art. So this is for those people who have an absolute passion for painting, right? So you love painting and uh, you enjoy working with people, right? So if you don't enjoy working with people, then this is probably not for you. But if you do, then uh, this is a great opportunity. So if you've got those two things and you like what we're doing here at Moore Art School with the Moore Certified Instructor Program, if, if that resonates with you, then this could be uh, a great opportunity for you. So basically, I've been teaching for about five years now, and um, it's been a real joy in my life. And in fact, what I want to do is show you some photos of some of my classes and so on. But I've been teaching for about five years, and I started out teaching in the local art supplies store, um, doing little classes and running those. And, and when I started, I wasn't that good an art teacher. And I made the mistake of not getting guidance or help from somebody, partly because the certification program that I did to become an art teacher, uh, there wasn't really a support network set up and, and they changed direction and so on. So I had to make up everything on my own, right, as I went. So uh, that was a little bit challenging. Um, but I started teaching art and found that I really enjoyed it. And as I got better at my own art and become a better artist, um, I also got better at teaching. And what I recognized is the way that art was being taught, because uh, I went to a number of different art classes, you know, with world famous artists down to the local art society teachers. And um, I realized that anybody who was good at art didn't really have a methodology for teaching art because most of what they'd learned 20 or 30 years earlier when they started their journey of art had moved to their unconscious mind. So it almost looked like they were creating art unconsciously or intuitively, right? And they had a hard time just articulating what the process was. So what I did was I sat down and watched hundreds and hundreds of DVDs and I watched them over and over again. And I didn't listen to what they were saying, but I watched what they were doing and I started to put the pieces together. And as a result of that, I refined my approach to how I was teaching art classes. And that's when I started to develop the more method of painting. And basically the most important thing we did was simplify everything right down um, to three colors, three steps, three brushes, and make it easier and, and, and just have a process that we took students through. As a result of that, students started to get great results. And, um, you know, and, and the teaching methodology clearly worked. And that's when I thought, okay, I've got a, a method here to teach absolute beginners who can come along to a, a one-day art class first time never picked up a brush before and walk home with a finished painting right and so the results were fantastic so what i did because of that i started to put that up on my website and so on and i had people from all around the world say to me hey can you show me how to become an art teacher we'd love to do what you're doing and that's why i created the more certified instructor program uh, which is a art teacher certification program with a difference right uh, it, it is different from all the other art teacher certification programs out there. So if you're familiar with Bob Ross, Bill Alexander, and a number of different certification programs, um, the way I've structured it is, is quite different. So what I did was start to put together that training program. As a result of that, I've had 
people from a variety of different countries. You know, we've got people in Ireland, um, USA, Canada, uh, UK, New Zealand, other places in Australia, Saudi Arabia, who have ta- have gone through the more certified instructor program and are now teaching art classes in their part of the world, right? So we know that the process and the system works for those who are serious about studying an art teaching business. The one thing that's really different about the more certified instructor program um, from others is the fact that I go into the business side of it. So my previous life, I was a marketing consultant and I was a coach and consultant to small business owners. So I had a few ideas around how to market, how to get students and so on. So half of what I teach in the more certified instructor program is the business side of it. Because there's no point being a great art teacher or a great artist if you can't attract students to you, right? There's, you just won't get very far. And I noticed that that was lacking from all the other art teacher certification programs. So that's why I put together our program. We continue to develop it today. Um, I do trainings and videos continuously um, and we're updating the content as well. And there's really never been a better time. I really believe that 2018 is gonna be a fantastic year for art teachers around the world for, for a few different reasons. Number one, the baby boomer market, um, those are in their 55 plus, they're flocking to learning how to paint in bigger numbers than ever before. When I started five years ago, not so many, right? But today, they're at a certain age where they're coming to learn to paint. Um, It's maybe been a dream of theirs all their life, but they had careers, they had families, responsibilities. And now as they get more into that sort of 55, 60 age group, um, they're now turning back to their passion of wanting to learn how to paint. And so there's more people than ever before, I believe, um, who want to learn how to paint. The interest has been rekindled in the creative pursuits, right? And, and learning to paint is certainly one of those. And um, the other thing is, of course, the internet. So Facebook and YouTube has made it possible for people all around the world. And I know there will be people who watch this video from all around the world, right? Um, you'll be in different countries all around the world who will watch this. Uh, so the internet has made it possible for you to reach out and find artists around the world who you love and you resonate with their style, right? Um, so that opens up doors. So I've been teaching for about five years now. I love it. Uh, but what I want to do is really uh, now empower more people who want to teach art as well and focus a lot more on the online uh, video and course creation as well because I see that there's a growing market of people who want to learn how to paint online. That's what I do, right? I buy courses from experienced artists all the time. Um, I just bought a, a streaming DVD last night from a UK artist, right? And, and I love it. And um, that's how I learn to paint most of these days, okay? Apart from doing my own painting, which obviously is a good teacher as well. So I just thought I'd share these thoughts with you. If you've been thinking about uh, learning how to paint, uh, sorry, starting an art teaching business, uh, Then, and, and you're thinking about it for 2018, now's the best time to start. Now's the time to get in and start going through our certification process and getting through the assignments so that when 2018 rolls around, you'll be ready to go, right? And, and there's a little bit of work setting up a business, but it's definitely worthwhile if you A, love painting, and B, enjoy working with people. So what I want to do is just share with you briefly... Uh, a few things on my desktop here. Hopefully you can all see my desktop. Um, and are these, oh, these photos aren't loading up. Oh, there they are. Here's just some photos from my art classes, right? And, and I get a real thrill out of uh, doing the art classes. And um, this is from when I was doing them down in Moorabbin at the Art Shed. Um, hi to all the Art Shed people. You, if you are in Australia and you want to order art supplies, Go to artshedonline.com, right? Um, but you know, when you uh, when you see all these smiling faces at the end of the day, and they've all completed great looking paintings, I mean, have a look at that. A lot of those people had never painted before, right? Um, I'm pretty sure that this person, this person, uh, this person, and I'm not sure about this lady here. I'm pretty sure that those guys hadn't painted before. Now, Bill had been to a few of our classes. Jess had been to one or two, and. Uh, Lynn, I think, had been to maybe one or two classes, right? Um, but they've all done a brilliant painting, and um, it's because there's a process and a methodology with the more method which really works. And, uh, you know, 
we've been able to prove that now over lots and lots of classes. I've done, I don't know, I've had hundreds of people go through my art, one day art classes. So we know that it works, right? Um, so, and then the other thing that I want to just share with you is, I'll just backtrack on that. Um, and I'll load this up while I'm talking. In fact, there's a couple of things that I want to share with you. Okay. So the first thing is like the, it's not only doing one day classes, maybe that's what your preference is. And, and I think that's good, but there's also this emerging world of online courses that artists are now flocking to and sales of, um, you know, courses and projects online. Um, you know, I, I think is growing exponentially around the world. Sorry, just having my coffee. Um, so, you know, that's why I'm moving in the direction of doing more and more online content. So we've got Learn to Paint TV. And um, if you haven't been to this website, then go and check it out. But basically, I'll just show you, just give you some a feeling of uh, some of the numbers if I can. No, let me just come up here. Just bear with me for one sec. Um, but there's a lot of interest from artists all around the world in online courses, online projects, etc. So this is the very first one I put up. <laughs> that was September 3rd. Okay. Now I haven't done a lot of promotion for this. I sort of posted on Facebook and I do, uh, you know, it goes up onto YouTube and so on. Um, but it's had 5,200 views. Now imagine in two or three years time, that episode will have had 50, 100,000 views, right? So there's clearly there's a lot, lot of interest. And that's just one episode of the new Learn to Paint TV show. There's clearly a lot of interest. Um, if you're watching this video right now, or you're a member of our Facebook page, then you're learning to paint online and you're looking, looking to connect with artists and art teachers online. And so that interest in that is growing exponentially, which is why I say that, you know, 2018, there's probably never been a better time ever than, um, you know, to start an art teaching business. So the other thing I'm doing is, you've probably all seen this, is our more members area, where we've got all of, all of our different courses, and I'm continuing to develop different courses and projects and things like that over time, right? Um, why? Because there's, A, there's a demand for it. Um, people want to learn. However, um, every time you create a, a video course or project as an art teacher, you can sell that over and over and over again for decades to come if you do them right okay they've got to be evergreen uh so that's a big advantage for those who are thinking about starting an art teaching business so what i've done is, as part of the more certified instructor um, part of the course i've created let me just see if i can find it here maybe it's not on here well what i did i've created the whole training around how to create online courses projects videos for those who are going through the more certified instructor program um, so you'll have access to that if you choose to join us in the more certified instructor program and uh, you know it, it's fairly detailed training because what I want to do is I want to create a network of teachers around the world who are certified in the more method of painting um, they've been through the MCI program and they're now running classes in their local area, right? But they're also starting to create their own video courses and projects. Why? Because I've got a platform here, right? Um, I'm happy to, as long as it meets certain standards, you know, and, and we'll talk about that, but I'm happy to promote your courses through my members area here, through the Learn to Paint TV and other platforms which I'm developing, which I haven't even talked to people about yet. But I'm basically, what I'm doing is creating an online platform for people who become art teachers, they become certified in the more method of painting and um, and they start creating good quality content. Now it's not easy, right? It takes time to learn how to create video content, but it's certainly possible. So that's just one option that's available. Um, and you know, I'm, you know, through my Facebook platform, my YouTube platform, I will promote those who go on and become more certified instructors, who use the more method of painting and start creating their own video based content then I'll absolutely promote those people as well. So I just thought I'd drop in and do this little live stream just to talk to you about the More Certified Instructor Program. There's never been a better time, I don't believe, than right now. There really hasn't. Because I've worked everything out for you. Um, I've applied not only my artistic creative side to develop a methodology of teaching that works, but also my business marketing background before more art school. Um, I put those two together, right, to create a, a method and a system 
that if you embrace it and you really wholeheartedly follow what I teach you, then you can create a successful art teaching business as well. Now, if that is something that is of interest to you, then there's a couple of things you can do right now. Um, first one is come and put your, your name and email into this page here. If you go to moreartschool.com, right, and then forward slash MC, pardon me, MCI forward slash, right, click return, that'll take you to this page. If you then enter your name and email address, click request access, you'll then be taken to a page um, which is this one here. This is our information page. It gives you all the information that you need, right? Now, just one little word of, uh, this video is a little bit outdated. I need to update it. So in there, I talk about, yes, you can paint TV. I've changed it to learn to paint TV, right? Um, so there's a few little things like that. Things have evolved. They're always evolving and growing and we're getting better and better all the time. So just be aware of that. But this page will give you all the information that you need, right? Um, I go through the whole story of how I started, um, what the opportunity is to teach uh, part painting. And, and I like to refer to it as spreading the magic in painting because I don't know about you, but I get an absolute joy out of painting and sharing that with people. Um, and so, you know, over the last few years, I've had more than 15,000 people come through more art school, um, take our courses and hundreds of them in one day classes. So I, I kind of have some experience and know what I'm talking about. And I know that I can help you if you've got the attitude that you want to really, you know, create an art teaching business. Um, so I talk a bit about the more method of painting on this page, show you real world evidence that we've got hundreds of people who have been through our classes, um, how to create an income as an art teacher. Okay. Um, how to start your own art teaching business. And then I talk about what's involved in becoming a more certified instructor. Now, I love this photo. Have a look at those smiling faces, right? There's no better feeling at the end of the day to go home, right? And, um, and know that you've created those sort of smiles and you've helped people who maybe had a dream of learning to paint but didn't think they could and they've gone home with a finished painting. Now, they're not masterpieces, right? But whoever creates a masterpiece in their very first painting? Nobody, right? But look at those smiles. That's what I absolutely love. And that's what gives me the, the joy to keep going and doing what I'm doing. Um, because I know I'm impacting people in a positive way, right? And they had a fun day, had a lot of laughs and, and um, enjoyed the process. So, you know, this is a, a class in Ireland from one of our art teachers, Saudi Arabia, um, Canada. I've just been sent a whole lot of photos from one of our teachers, Heather, um, who's going through the more certified instructor program in the US at the moment, and um, and she sent me a whole lot of photos of her first class, right? Um, so I'll hopefully be posting those up to Facebook soon. So we've been able to duplicate me into other countries around the world, and we know absolutely that it works. So basically, how do you go through the certification program? Step one, there's a whole lot of training modules, so you go through those, and they're very comprehensive. You wanna take notes, right? Step two, there's eight painting assignments. So you need to be at a certain level of painting, it doesn't matter if you're starting out as a beginner right now, right? Don't be put off by that. Um, obviously, it's an advantage to be a reasonably good painter right now, but if you're an absolute beginner but and this really appeals to you, then don't worry about it because by the time you go through the eight painting assignments, you will become a better painter and you'll be ready to actually go out and start teaching. Um, every time you do one of the painting assignments, you take photos, you send them to me, and I'll give you feedback, right, and critique. And if I don't think you've completed that assignment correctly, or to a high enough level, I will let you know. So you can redo it and I'll tell you what to do to improve it, right? So um, you've got eight painting assignments to do. There's, you need to do two actual classes. Now, you know, don't be put off by this because what I did was I got my wife and uh, her girlfriend and her girlfriend's mum and uh, you know, gathered them together and did my first couple of classes with them, right? So that's not a problem at all. Um, as long as you've got two or three people in the class, that's fine. The idea is to give you the experience of what it's like to actually teach a class. And trust me, the first two you do are the hardest and they get easier and easier in time, right? Um, there's a written exam. I wanna make sure that you really understand um, the principles of painting correctly and our methodology, the more method of painting. So there's a written exam. It's pretty easy to go through though, right? And then we've got a whole lot of ongoing training. Um, and I'll give you an example. Um, recently, I decided that I wanted to show those in our more certified instructor program how to go out and get new students even when you're just starting out from scratch, right? So I moved to this 
beautiful area here on the Sunshine Coast. And I hadn't started running classes. All my students were back in Melbourne, right? So we moved up here and um, I thought, okay, I need to start doing some art classes. Now there's a little country town about 40 minutes up the road, a town called Gimpy. And uh, what I did was I thought, well, I'll just go and start classes there. I didn't know anybody except for one lady in Gimpy. And um, I went and started classes there and I recorded the process. Um, I started doing a series of videos on the online marketing and Facebook marketing that I was doing to attract students into those classes. And it absolutely worked. And um, all of that's available to you to teach you how I went about getting students you know, in an absolutely cold market. Yeah. Um, so here's some you know, snapshots of the videos, um, training modules. You know, so I'll, maybe I'll just go through these briefly with you. There's an overview video, gives you a bit of an overview and background of what we're doing. Um, there's how to establish an art teaching business. So this is what do you have to do to get things set up and so on. How to run classes and workshops. So it's very comprehensive. I mean, this is a little snapshot here, an hour into an hour and 36 minute video. And I talk about how to set up the room, you know, all the different things you need to think about for setting up the room. How to run the classes and workshops. How to use the more method of painting and the steps and so on. Um, then a complete training on marketing and getting students. Now this particular one is an hour and 29, but there's probably another 10 hours worth of videos on marketing and attracting students in there. Because I think that's an important part. In fact, the additional marketing and training, um, very comprehensive, right? And there's that's the case study that I was talking to you about. So there's a number of videos in the case study that'll show you how I went about getting students, right? So basically, I'm on a mission. I want to. I know that the more method of painting works. I want to spread it around the world, and um, I really want to bring to people around the world who have had a dream of learning how to paint, but maybe didn't think that they could, or that they knew how, or didn't know what the steps were. I want to share the magic in painting with those people. Share the more method of painting. So I want to create a global movement, a network of art teachers around the world. And in time, as we get enough art teachers up and running, um, you know, we can then network together and share ideas and brainstorm and, and so on. So uh, that's the direction that we're going in. There's information about payments. You can make one payment, or you can spread it out over 15 months if you like. It's 9.97 Australian is if you make one payment, and um, that works out to be about $700 US right now um, on the exchange rate. Now, don't quote me on that because it depends on when you watch this video and so on, but it's roughly 700 US. So you think about it. By the time you've run two classes with six to eight people, you've got all your money back, right? It's paid for itself. And these are skills that you can use for five, 10, 15, 20 years time building an art school, okay? So this is cheap and I'm thinking about in 2018 putting this up because I put a lot of work and effort into this, right? So I'm thinking about putting it up. Um, if you want to reduce payments, $97 Australian a month, 15 payments. Uh, so you're going to pay a bit more if you spread the payments out. But still, that works out to be about $70 US a month, right? Um, and again, you only need to run a few classes and you'd absolutely get your money back. So you can go and read all that information, um, etc. So that's the page there. The other thing that I'm doing, and I'll put this in the uh, the notes section of this video, is I'm doing a series of webinars, um, how you can start an art teaching business. You can come and register for this. So it'll be in the comments or the notes section of this video. Come and register, and um, we would love to have you join us on the webinar, and I'll talk to you more about um, becoming a more certified instructor. So anyway, I just thought I'd drop in, share these ideas with you, Hope that uh, if you have an interest in this, then um, that you'll come and join us. If you're thinking about 2018, there's never, ever been a better time than right now. So, um, you know, make the decision to come and join us if this is of interest to you. And uh, I'd love to work with you. I'd love to help you out building your own art teaching business. If you have questions, leave a comment here. If you like this video, then please like it, share it so we can get the word out. I'd really appreciate that. Uh, but leave a question or a comment or email me, rodmoreart at gmail.com or rod at moreartschool.com. Either one of those will work. Um, so feel free to email me any questions, etc., cetera, um, comments, concerns, um, and I'm happy to you know work with you and answer your, any of those questions. Hope that's been of interest and helpful. And um, 
thank you very much, um, Michelle. Um, please, if, if it is of interest, then uh, go to moreartschool.com forward slash MCI. You can enter your details in there and uh, you can get access to that page that I showed you with all the details. And we would love to have you join us. Um, so, you know, there's never been a better time for it. And uh, we'd love to have you join us. Um, Michelle, I think you're in New Zealand. So, um, you know, there's plenty of scope for more art teachers in New Zealand, trust me. Um, anyway, so that's enough from me. Please leave a comment, question, and I'm happy to answer them. And I look forward to, if you think you're the right person, I look forward to you joining us as a more certified instructor soon. Cheers.